Hello guys and girls, welcome back to the Racing Line for another circuit guide here on iRacing. This is week 4 of season 1 2022 in the D-Class Fix Ferrari Challenge with me, driving the Ferrari 488 GT3 Evo 2020. This week's circuit is Okayama International Circuit. We're back for the full course layout. Date and time is set to the 1st of April 2022 at 12.45 in the afternoon to match the official race time sent out on the season 1 PDF. Uh, all circuit guides use a sprint setup, same format as before, a breakdown lap followed by a full speed uninterrupted lap followed by an off board lap and as usual this is filmed before the week has begun so it's difficult to compare lap times but let's see if we can help you guys find some time. So here we go then on the main straight we're on the left hand side ready for the right hander of turn one, we're looking for the 100 meter board which is under the bridge in the shadow, uh, hard on the brakes from fifth down into second gear. Watch closely as we trail break in and then start smoothly applying the accelerator on the exit. We want to get back over to the right hand side on the exit looking for this little marshall hut just before we get to there as it's about to go out of our view we're going to dab the brakes and go down into second gear coast in and again smoothly apply the throttle until you know you're going to make it and not touch that gravel on the outside up through the gears we go holding it tight to the left tight to the right and then aiming to be on the left hand side of the circuit here next braking zone is in between the 100 and the 50 so the 75 meter mark hard on the brakes from fourth and we're actually going to go into first here at the apex point you can see here and then start applying that pressure as soon as you can you need to get nice and early on the front for this straight you can see here we had a big snap of oversteer there as it's our first lap on these tires uh, so be careful of that we lost about a tenth but don't worry about it because the next lap it shouldn't be there once your tires are warm hard on the brakes for this next one on the 100 meter board hard on the brakes from fifth down into first gear braking in a nice straight line as soon as you start getting to the apex start trail braking in coast round smoothly apply the pressure get over to the right hand side this braking zone is a tricky one it's about car length before that dirt we're going to dab the brakes and we're going to keep it in gear two just to get the nose in as the track falls away from us get back on that power using all the curb on the exit and then the next braking zone is this curb here once you cross over that little road dab the brakes keep it in second again smoothly apply the power using all the curb on the exit careful of the grass though next braking zone is an easy one it's the 50 meter board hard on the brakes from third down into first again trail braking in you can see coming off the brakes at the apex smoothly apply the pressure on the throttle now no real braking zone for this just at the top end of first gear you're going to dab the brakes again to scrub off some speed and again coast round just like the hairpin before don't touch the grass like i did there big lift for this second to last right hander in third gear and then the final braking zone is just as this curb ends on the left hand side we're going to dab the brakes down into second gear again coast in and as soon as you feel comfortable full power doesn't need to be too smooth here full power using all the curve on the exit and then away we go and across the line for a 128 Point three here at Okayama on the full layout. Now full speed uninterrupted going over what we just went over. Looking for the 100 meter board. Hard on the brakes down to second gear. Coast in. Apply that power smoothly from this point and then there you go. Full speed up through the gears third. Over to the Marshall Hut. Dab the brakes down to second coast. Smoothly apply the power. We're going to make it full throttle now up through the gears. Hold it tight to the left hand side of the apex. It's a one car lane through here. Second time Back over to the left, 75 meter board down into first gear, back on the power straight away before the apex point, up into second, careful of the oversteer as it's a little bit uh, sort of unsettling through there on the exit as you climb up the hill. Up through the gears now, keep it to the left hand side unless you're going to defend a race position. 100 meter board is where we're going to break, hard on the brakes, fifth down into first gear start turning in tray or breaking in and then smoothly apply the power getting onto the right hand side as soon as you can dab the brakes in second hit that apex smooth on the power use all the curb on the exit next curb dab the brakes again again at that apex point start accelerating nice and smoothly use all the curb on the exit careful of the grass 50 meter board hard on the brakes third down to first coast in smoothly apply that power get over to the left hand side quick dab the brakes again coast in in first gear just as you hit that top end of the rev range up through the gears now you're going to reach third quick lift off back on the power again green curb ends down to second turn in and again at that apex point so there's a lot of coasting on this circuit at the apex point you can get back on that power and away we go down the main straight for a 128.3 as usual, that is pretty much it from me, so I'm going to leave you with this off-board lap. Don't forget to keep those likes and comments coming in and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. The road to 10k begins this year. We are trying to get to 10,000 subscribers by Christmas 2022, and we need your, you guys to help us out. As usual, if I don't see you on track this week, then I'll see you next week for the next video here on The Racing Line. Peace!